is what can you not do when you are in the state of major impurity? When you are in the state of needing a shower, what can you not do at that time? So, when you are in the state of major impurity, you cannot read the Quran Sharif. You cannot read the Quran Sharif. So, especially for those that are half is here or becoming half is here, Alhamdulillah, we have a few people. When you are in that state, don't you can't read the Quran Sharif because for them, they can read it without touching the Quran Sharif. So for touching, you need wuzu. But if you don't have wuzu and you read without touching it, then that's allowed. So for example, another situation, one is reading off by heart. Number two is Quran Sharif's open. You get a pen. It's not recommended, but you have a pen and you're moving the pages with the pen. That is also allowed. But when you're in the state of a major impurity, you can't even read the Quran Sharif. That isn't allowed. Huh, there's a question here. Is that when you go to sleep, what should you be reading before you go to sleep? So Ayatul Kursi. Okay, you read Ayatul Kursi. So the scholars have said Ayatul Kursi or reading Kul Hu Allahu Ahad or reading the last two verses of Surah Baqarah. Whilst you're in the major state of impurity, you can read those surahs even though it's from the Quran. The reason is because you're not reading those uh, Ayatul Kursi and last few surahs with the purpose of reciting the Quran, you're reading it as a form of zikr, you're reading it as a form of protection. So that will be allowed. Okay. The other things you can't do when you're in the state of major impurity is you can't read namaz. Okay. So if you don't have wuzu or, and you obviously need a ghusl, then obviously you can't read namaz in that state. Number three, <clears throat> anything else that comes to mind? That you can't do in the major state of impurity is you can't come into the masjid okay so you if you're in the major state of impurity you don't come into the main jamaat khana so if you're on jamaat you go for jamaat somewhere or you're in etikaf in etikaf sometimes you have a wet dream straight away you should leave the jamaat khana without delaying the shower go have your shower and then come back in Okay, and for the women, not for us. So remember, the major state of impurity for women, they can't fast. Okay, for us, if somebody starts the fast in the state of major impurity, so they started the fast. Sari was at 3.55 a.m. and they just had a wet dream 3.54. There's not enough time to go have a shower. Their fast is valid. It does not affect the validity of the fast at all. Similarly, you had the uh, a wet dream Midway through the fast, do you think your fast is going to be broken? No, your fast remains intact. For men, being in the major state of impurity, the a fast will not be broken or it is not required of you not to keep a fast. <coughs> yes. Uh, 